Well, Iowans who are hungry and homeless this Christmas need your help. KCCI's Tommy Clark is live at Bethel Mission off 6th Avenue. And Tommy, right now, Hope Ministries needs food donations, right? That's right, Elizabeth. We're in the Hope Cafe where they're serving breakfast to those in need right now. But this Christmas, they really need your help. And here to explain is Kathy Cody with Hope Ministries. Thanks for joining us. So start by telling us about your Christmas meal and really how Iowans can help out with it. On Christmas Day, we will be serving and delivering about 2,500 meals in the Des Moines community. So we have over 200 volunteers lined up to help us get meals out to those who called in and requested a meal delivery. And we'll also be serving a meal here at our Hope Cafe from noon to one. So the community partners with us with food donations, with financial contributions, and helps us provide this outreach. And like you said, 2,500 meals for that day alone. So tell us how people can help out with that. People can help us with the Christmas meal in a couple ways. So if they want to come on site and do something as a family, they can come on Saturday, December 23rd from 9 to 1. We'll be collecting food here at, at Bethel Mission, ready to serve dinner rolls, cookies and baggies, and we need meat, products, dairy items, hopeiowa.org. Our website has all that information. And then financial donations always help us provide our meals, our shelter, our life recovery programs. And tell us why it's so important. I mean, you guys really reach so many people. Tell us about the importance of people helping out with this. So there is huge need in our community. Some of it we see and some of it is largely invisible to most of us on a daily basis. But on an average day, Hope Ministries is providing 450 free meals. So we're serving free meals every day of the year, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And so that added up to over 175,000 meals last year alone. So there is really huge need in the community. And being 100% privately funded, we require and are blessed to have the partnership of thousands of Iowans who come alongside us to, to do this. And I'm glad you said that. You really depend on the community to make this possible. We really do. Yeah, we're ending year 102. Uh, Bethel Mission started in 1915 and we've been 100% privately funded that whole time. So it truly is a miracle that so many people partner with us every year. Anything else we can get out there right now that you'd want Iowans to know? We're just very thankful to be part of this community. It's a very giving community and we're thankful that at Christmas time there are lots of people who help us to share this message of hope. Exactly. Very well yeah. said. Okay. Well, if you need to learn anything else or if you want to help out, just head on over to their website, hopeiowa.org. Again, they're helping thousands of people, so they definitely need your help during this holiday season. Reporting live in Des Moines, Tommy Clark, KCCI News, Iowa's News Leader.